What is happening friends? Welcome back to another card opening video. My name is Josh, the channel is Card Dynasty, and it is your mom's favorite YouTube channel. Today we are opening MVP 2020-2021 hockey. I really dug opening hockey the last time when I opened up some upper, upper Deck Series 1, and I got a ton of value out of that. I got some great rookie hits. I'll put that video up here for you. Hockey's overlooked, guys. In this time where it's becoming really hard to find things, hockey might be a great place to um, start diversifying some of your investments and opening some different things as well if you just enjoy cracking things open. And that is what we're gonna do today. We've got 2021 MVP from Upper Deck. We're gonna crack these bad boys open. Before we do, please hit that subscribe and ring that bell. We're coming at you every week with three to five videos uh, card opening videos, investing strategies, uh, mail days, collecting strategies, different things like that. You're gonna love it and we'd love to have you come along so you don't miss another video. It is your mom's favorite channel so you don't wanna disappoint her. Let us get into it. 2020 to 2021 Upper Deck MVP Hockey. All right, my friends, here we go. MVP Hockey from Upper Deck, it is time. As mentioned in my intro, I am a believer in hockey. I have really enjoyed opening hockey this year, and it's something that you can still get a hold of. So if you are overlooking hockey or you feel like you just don't understand it, you start to learn a little bit. I have been, and I've been very happy with the decision to do so. Uh, let us get into it here. What do we got on these bad boys? There's five cards per pack <laughs> and there are 21 packs per box. We're gonna do two boxes. This is 42 packs total. See me doing math? Um, take that Mr. Kim, a math teacher in high school. I can do it. I can do it. Okay, and here we go chock full. Man, what do we got under here? It feels weird. Man, secure. Away. All right, guys. These almost feel like gravity packs, um, but they're not. They're just, they're just small. It's schmutz there. All right, let's jump in. I, I'm still learning the game of hockey and the players and the modern game. So I, if I miss something, you guys have got to let me know. Let me know. Um, I just truly don't. I don't have the breadth of knowledge quite yet. All right, we got Ryan Nugent Hopkins. Uh, there is Nathan McKinnon, and it also says checklist, and it is indeed a checklist. There is Brian Rust. There's Thomas Chabot, or Chavo, who knows? Nick Suzuki with the Canadiens. These are really nice cards. I don't know if that pack was good at all. I'm looking for rookies and like four dudes that I know the name of, you know what I mean? But I will become much more versed as time goes on. Logan Couture. Here we go with a, an MVP parallel. That is uh, from the Washington Capitals, TJ Oshie. Really nice card there. Looking for any numbering, and I don't see it, but still a really cool card. Uh, Victor Arvidsson there. Is that? I'm just noticing some of the cards. Victor Arvidsson here has a, it's like indented in there. It's not a true auto. It's it's um, kind of emblazoned on the card, but not everybody has those. So this must be some type of parallel or something. And you, you don't see that on this Braden Point, uh, this Braden Point card here. Um, Braden Point's a good one. So uh, Jamie Ben brings up the rear on that one. I'm gonna set aside inserts, players that I know are solid. Um, I miss the days of card collecting when you were a kid. And remember what you were going for was all those inserts. Now it's all relics and autos, right? But back in the day, like you get that cool all-star insert. And that was that was one of the like main reasons you did it, you know? Uh, there's Andrew Shaw. 
There is Jared Spurgeon, and here comes a parallel. Looks like a hollow. It says Net Crashers on it, and no numbering or anything like that, but still kind of a neat hollow card. Really neat hollow card. Great photography on that. They did a good job with the holographics and putting that defender kind of in black and white. There's Nick Letty. And here we have Matt Duchesne, I believe. That's how that's said. Keep it moving. Alex Kalorn. There is Wayne Simmons. Alexander Yellison. This seems to be some type of teal parallel. Um, so that's pretty cool. Zach Hyman, unfortunate last <laughs> Matthew uh, Ch Chachuk, Chachuk, guys. We did get this rookie um, teal parallel. That's kind of cool. Alrighty, let's keep it moving. I'm trying to go quick. I know we got a lot of cards here, guys. I know. I really appreciate you hanging out with me today and doing some, doing some hockey. There's Brady Skidgy, Skidgy, Andreas Johnson with the Maple Leafs. There's Jacob Slavin with the Canes. Alexander Radulov, Radulov, and Anzi Kopitor. Kopitor. I always thought that baseball would be my hardest one with the um, pronouncing names because I'm so bad at pronouncing names. You know, with all the um, the Latin American players, but nope, hockey's the worst. Uh, Jordan Bennington. There's Philip Zadina. Here is Jansen Harkins. That's a rookie. See that on the bottom? This oh, it has an auto in the middle. Is that a legit auto? I don't know. I don't think so, guys. It might be, though. Who knows? We'll look it up later. Got Max Pacioretty. Max Pacioretty, and then Ryan Johansson with Nashville. That's cool if it is. I don't think it is. It looks too, it looks, looks too perfect. You know what I mean? I doubt it, but it is a rookie, so we'll set him aside. All right, we're still trucking. Mark Shifili, Mark Shifili. Uh, Jacob Baracic, got Jeff Carter with something in the middle there. It says, that's weird. It's got like, whoa, look, it's reverse. It's like a weird, look at this weird reverse, like error almost. This is, this is the stuff that should be on the back. Now look at the back. That's pretty dope. I don't. I'm sure that's intentional, like a, a planted error card, but um, that's really neat. I actually kind of dig that. So I'm saying, ho hockey's got some things, guys. I'm telling you, don't overlook it. It is, it's fun. There's a lot of really cool, uh, really cool stuff in here. And again, it, I don't know if it's going to have the value. My last pack, my last box opening did for sure. Uh, Evander Kane, great name, Sean. Couture, Couturier, Couturier, Jonathan Toes, Towns. That's a one of those parallels. Um, there's Seth Jones, and there is Ivan Pavarov. Ivan Pavarov. We'll set that teal parallel over to the side. That's pretty dope. Okay, guys, we're still going. Man, oh man, alive. This might be a long one. Oh. That's what she said. <laughs> Yeah, I had to do it. Sorry guys, there's one in every video. <clears throat> All right, spoiled some there. That was a horrible opening. David Rittich, there's Brett, Brent Burns, Jonathan Huberdeau, Huberdeau uh, Patrick Marlowe, and Mika Zibanejad there. Here we 
ago, Jas uh, Jesper Bratt. The Devils, Nate Schmidt. We got a parallel coming up. Another MVP, Jacob Markstrom. Pretty neat parallel. I really like the parallels in here. They just look great. Um, there's Artem Anis Anisimov. And there's Zach Wierenski. I butchered that pack too, huh? Good job. There's Devin Dub Dubnik. Devin Dubnik. Hampus Lindholm. Great name. Adam Henrique. There's Timo Mayer. And Jacob Vrana. Caps. We're getting close on this first box, guys. We're making good time. Hang in, hang in. I feel like we got to do more than one box, you know? You got to really get an idea of what's in these things. Mark Stone, uh, John Klingberg, there's Timothy Lil Liljegren, a rookie teal parallel, and there's Clayton Keller and Capo Caco. Well, that's interesting. Moving right along here, Josh Morrissey. There's Philip Grubauer. Here is a mirror mirror of Brent Burns. Powerful beard on Mr. Burns there. Um, and then Roman Yossi and Tyler Seguin. Um, and that mirror mirror is not really, I don't think that's that coveted it doesn't have any um no numbering or anything like that but still looks pretty looks pretty cool upper deck does a great job you know treat everything like it's stadium clubbish um jacob markstrom eric gustafson gustafson here's another one of those weird error cards here's roman yossi we saw him and there's the stuff on the back and the stuff that should be on the back is on the front that's kind of neat uh zach parisi and Derek uh, Quim, Quim, Kimper, Derek Quimper, man. All right, here we go with Jake Gwensel again. I think we've seen him a couple times. Mike Smith, um, another one of those errors, this time of Kyle, uh, Kyle Connor. Yep, there it is in the back. That time of his stick, Victor Olofsson, Victor Olofsson and JT Miller in the back, which I kind of spoiled before I even flipped them. So that's okay. Here is Sebastian Ajo. Sebastian Ajo. There is Brock Nelson. Uh, John Tavares. There's that teal parallel again. No numbering. Set him aside. Danny De Kaiser, Danny De Kaiser. Whoops. And Cam Fowler. So far, not a ton of rookies, right? Um, cards these days have become quite rookie driven. And this product, at least thus far, doesn't have a ton. Uh, Anders Lee. Kyle Connor again. There's Carter Hart. Dylan Larkin and Andre Valles Valles I'm so sorry about this pronunciation guys this is yeah there's Keith Yandel Jake Muzzin there's Kyler Yamamoto assuming called Kyler Eric Stahl and Brandon Saad. Saad, Saad. Saad, Saad. One of the two. Shout out to the Gadfather, Gad Saad, huh? Chris Letang. Alexander Barkov. Here we go with another one of those. We got Chris Kreider. The uh, Rangers is an MVP. Yep, no numbering. There's Patrice 
Bergeron, and Christian Dvorak, I'm assuming. Alex Pietre... <laughs> Pietrangelo, Pietrangelo, Jacob Silverberg, Anthony Angelo, that's a rookie in the parallel, the teal parallel there. That's pretty cool. Um, Anthony Mantha and Jonathan Druin. Okay, guys, we are almost there with the first box. A lot of stuff in there. Holy smokes. Brian Rust. We got Junus Corpusalo. We got Junus Corpusalo. This appears to actually be an auto. This looks like a legit auto on here. It's definitely a parallel. That one's pretty cool. Charlie McAvoy and then Travis Zachik. Guys, I have about 58,000 cards in front of me. Give me one second, let me clean up, we'll do the second box. All right guys, sorry about that and thanks for hanging in. I had to clean up. I tried while I was cleaning up to verify if that Eunice uh, Coupe, whatever card was a legit auto and I, I couldn't find anything. Um, so I'm hoping you can. It'd be great if you could tell me, did we get something pretty cool there? Um, and we have our second box to do. So that'd be, that'd be pretty cool to have gotten um, gotten a nice a nice pull out of these these are not an expensive card uh, and I'm sorry an expensive box to get so um, that would be pretty cool if we could have pulled something really nice all right let's get out of here all right here we go hang in there guys we got Victor Hedman Nick Foligno, Fling, Oscar Clefbaum, uh, Jason Zucker Zach Casey All right, and Josh Morrissey, Philip uh, Grabauer, Jacob Markstrom, Adam Henrique, and Timo Meyer. Imagine we're gonna start seeing quite a bit of duplication. Uh, still looking for, hopefully, something that we can really tell is an auto. Um, and of course, those parallels, those teal parallels and some great rookies are still out there. So Eric Gustafson, Jake Wenzel, Jake Evans, now that, see that looks just like the uh, the Zunus one. So this is Jake Evans, a rookie. I think this is legit, guys. I think this is a legit auto. Put that one over there. That's pretty dope if it is. Jake Evans, there's Alec Tuch, or Touch, Tuch. Oh, it helps you on the back, it's Alex Tuck. The cards actually have a, a phonetic pronunciation on the back. You done messed up, A.A. Ron! That's helpful, Upper Deck. Thank you. That Jake Evans looks like a legit, legit auto. So that would be really cool to have gotten two autos um, today. So, uh, Shea Weber, Braden Shen, Anthony Manta, Jonathan Druin, and Charlie McAvoy. You know, tops and panini, they typically have something on there that'll kind of indicate, you know, tops has like the big congratulations on there, and panini will put something on the back, you know. Brandon Sutter, uh, Brendan Gallagher, Tuka Rask, Travis Zajak, Zajak and Alex Deb Debrincat. Debrincat. That's a great name. That's fun to say. All right, guys, we got Tristan Jari, Drew Dotti, Oliver uh, Bjork, Bjorkstrand, and it's one of those intentional error cards. Uh, Mark Giordano 
and James Van Rem Rimsdick. Rimsdick. It's one of the great parts about these hockey products. They really don't jip you on the on the retail side. Get a couple of autos. Um, Dougie Hamilton, Nikita Kucherov, Austin Matthews in a teal parallel, Jimmy Howard, and Rocco Grimaldi. You know, you don't really get a ton of autos, and even, even if you do in retail products for other sports, it's usually on a sticker, and you know, those ones look, look great. There's uh, Gabriel Land Landeskog, Casper Kapenin, there's Shea Weber, Jacob Truba, and John Carlson. I used to work with a guy named John Carlson. I don't think they were the same guy. 100% sure of it, actually. Patrick Lane starts this one off. Marcus Johansson. Here comes another one. Tyler Seguin. I think we got that one earlier. The MVP insert. Jeff Petrie. Petrie there. And then Cam Atkinson. Keeping it moving. Philip Forsberg. Pekka Rin, Rini. Here's another Net Crashers. This time we have Elias Peterson. Really cool card there. That camera angle from back in the net. Uh, Bo Horvitt and then Alex Ovechkin. There's Elias Lindholm again. We got Ryan Sutter, Josh Norris from the Senators, a rookie card in a teal parallel. He looks extremely young, Mr. Norris. Andre Sveshnikov and Corey Crawford. Hopefully Mr. Norris is a good rookie pull because that teal makes it pretty neat. Teal parallel. Any fans out there tell me anything about Josh Norris? Our name is almost the same. Uh, Mike Smith, Sebastian Ajo again. We got Calvin Thurkov, a, a rookie card. Another uh, parallel there, another teal. Uh, Artem Anisimov and Zach Wierenski. Closes that one out. So we did better on the rookies. This box, I would say, could be wrong. I haven't exactly counted them up, but it feels that way thus far. There is Craig Anderson, there's Miko Rantanen, Jeff Carter, Phil Kessel, and Jean-Gabriel Pagot. I think I pronounced the hell out of that one. What do you guys think? Powerful French. All right, Brock Nelson again, Anders Lee, Clayton Keller, Roman Yossi, and Capo Kako again. Definitely starting to see some duplication. I believe the checklist on this thing's only like 200 cards. So, I think almost 100 between these two boxes. Kyle Connor, the base checklist, I should say. Carter Hart. Um, here's another MVP. There's Kerry Rice. Slide that one over. Uh, Tyler Seguin again and Zach Parisi again. Yeah, so if you get a couple of these, you're definitely going to be looking at some duplication. There's Keith Yandel or Yandley, Jake Muzin, Alex. Pietrangelo, we saw that again, and there's that weird reverse thing that they do. Oh, you know what this is? I just realized what this is. These are puzzle cards. Thanks, Captain Obvious. So on the back, you can put together a puzzle from a, a player. Um, it, it's 
it's kind of silly. Uh, so it's not an error. I was saying that before and that was dumb. Uh, Darcy Kumper and Victor Olofsson. So not an intentional error card. It's a giant puzzle if you collect them all. I used to do things like that back in the day more, I, th I feel like. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe they're doing them more now. You know, Don Russ has the spellbound in football. Uh, there's Chris Letang. Alex Pietrangelo again, uh, Martin Kaut, rookie, um, Teal, JT Miller, and Danny DeKaiser. Danny DeKaiser. Looks like we got four more guys. Hang in there. This one's a long one. I know. I know, I know, I know. Oh, I'm going to butcher this pack. Open that one with a chainsaw, for God's sake. Lord in heaven. Alexander Barkov, Bob Sif Sifferberg, or Jakob Sifferberg, Amir Amir, there's Nikita Kucherov, there's Cam Fowler, and there's Dylan Larkin. Not to be mistaken with the great Barry Larkin of the Cardinals. Okay guys, Brian Rust, once again. We got Eunice Corpusalo again. We have his auto. There's one of those um, uh, puzzle cards. Andre Yasilovsky, and then Kyler Yamamoto, once again. Two more packs. It's getting kind of hot in my studio, man. These lights. Still muggy. We're starting to have better weather in Atlanta, but it's still muggy. Alexander Steen, Dustin Brown, Josh Bailey, Eric Stahl, and Brandon Sad again. Finally, we've reached our last pack. Finally! Okay, one more rookie. There's Ricard Raquel. Alec Martinez, there's Jake Eichel, Eichel, it's a um, uh, teal parallel, not a rookie, uh, Patrice Bergeron again, and then finally Christian Dvorak bringing us home. Holy smokes guys, we did it. Let's recap. All right guys, thank you so much for hanging in there with me for two, count them, two blaster boxes of MVP hockey 2020 to 2021. Um, there's a lot of rookies I need to go through here um, and check them all out, but when you watch this video, I will have edited prices for what I can tell um, from eBay. I really like this product. I really like hockey in general, and it's really overlooked right now. I really think you should be taking a look at hockey. There is some, some value to be had for sure, and um, if they're fun products, and right now is still a good time to get them. Thank you very much. I know today was a long one and I appreciate you guys hanging out. This was a lot of fun opening these. We'll see you on the next one.